Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It's your buddy Dan from FRZ Trading. Today, I am going to show you how you can improve any trading view strategy using our friend, ChatGPT. So without further ado, let's jump in. For this purpose, you can simply use the generic ChatGPT. However, you could expect better results if you select a custom GPT that is dedicated to trading view or pine scripts. Let me show you how you can do it first. Select Custom GPTs on the left menu and then type in TradingView on the search field. Then you will see many custom GPTs dedicated to TradingView and Pine Scripts. Let's select the one with the most conversations. There are several ways to improve a TradingView strategy using ChatGPT. The simplest way is just copy the strategy code onto ChatGPT and ask to improve it. Let me show you this with an example strategy. You can use any strategy which provides the source code. Let's select this momentum strategy. Currently, it is near break even with just a 30% win rate and a horrible profit factor. Now right click on the strategy name on the right pane and then select source code. Then just copy the code and get back to our custom chat GPT and paste the code there. Then tell chat GPT that you need to increase the win rate. Then it will simply improve the strategy and provide you with an updated code. Now head back to TradingView, create a working copy and paste the code there. Finally click on Add to Chart to update the strategy tester. Sometimes you may get compilation errors. In that case, you can copy and paste the error on ChatGPT and it will provide you with the corrected code. It compiled without errors in our case. Now, you will notice that we have a higher win rate and a much better profit factor. Likewise, you can keep asking ChatGPT to further improve it in various aspects. Guys, it is that simple. The next method you could use is to add common indicators as filters to existing strategies. Let me show you an example. I will select this technical rating strategy. Now get its source code and paste it on ChatGPT. Then ask it to reveal its primary strategy. Primary strategy could be anything such as trend following, reversal, breakout, momentum, scalping, range bound, or swing trading. So it seems to be a mixture of several strategies, but it does use trends as an input. Here are some of the common indicators we can use as filters for different strategies. You can try adding these indicators to your existing strategy to improve the results. Let's try adding a moving average to our selected strategy. Let's try 20 simple moving average. Just ask ChatGPT to filter the strategy with 20 SMA. Then just paste the updated code to trading view as usual. Then just add to the chart. Now you can see that we have increased our profitability with the new filter. You can play with different indicators to identify which gives the best results. Now let's look at the third way that you can use indicators to filter the strategy signals. This method requires some effort from your side and is suitable for those who are experienced in trading. Here we try out different indicators and visually see if the indicator can filter out bad signals while retaining the winners. Of course, you will have to forego some winning trades in filtering bad ones, but it should ultimately increase the win rate. I have selected a strategy and it seems that the super trend indicator could possibly increase the win rate by filtering the bad trades. So let's try to incorporate this super trend into the strategy I have selected. Once we have selected the indicator, the process is simple. Just copy and paste both the strategy and indicator code onto ChatGPT and ask it to use the indicator as a filter for the strategy. Once it provides the updated strategy code, simply copy and paste it on TradingView.
you can see that with the Super Trend filter, the win rate has become slightly higher than the original value. Likewise, you can try out different indicators and you can use more than one indicator to filter out signals based on your testing. So that's all guys. If you have any questions, just leave a comment. Thank you for watching and see you around.